The following program is an original production of Link TV. Next up, witchcraft, HIV, and some hard lessons learned. An award-winning comedy and other short films from Link TV's View Change Film Contest. View Change is about people making real progress in tackling the world's toughest issues. Can a story change the world? See for yourself in View Change. Health is hope. Around the world, good health care is about reaching people with whatever they may need. Sometimes it's getting food to malnourished children, or getting support to teens with HIV, or even sending the hospital to the patient. From Malawi to Ecuador, see some of healthcare's most inventive solutions, and stay tuned to see the winner of the View Change Film Contest Leadership Prize. Malnutrition. Every year, malnutrition kills twice as many children as AIDS, tuberculosis, and malaria combined. Yet there is hope. An inexpensive, revolutionary therapy is saving children's lives right now. Since 2004, Project Peanut Butter has been treating children in Malawi, a country with one of the highest malnutrition rates in the world. As a faculty member at Washington University Medical School, Dr. Minari founded Project Peanut Butter to bring the most effective malnutrition therapy to the children who need it most. Alefa is seven months old. She is just entering the critical six-month to two-year-old window where children are most vulnerable to the impact of malnutrition. Alefa is uh, severely malnourished and um, marasmic, as you can see from the extremely small arms. Severely malnourished children at this age are at great risk. Untreated, more than half will die. Pilarani is two years old. Severely malnourished kids often swell up with edema, a painful buildup of fluid under the skin. Pilarani's swelling is so severe he can barely walk. Until recently, the best treatment available for Pilarani and Alefa was one to two months of hospitalization. But even in the best rural hospitals, only 25 to 40 percent of children fully recovered. Project Peanut Butter gets much better results by distributing a special ready-to-use therapeutic food to the mothers who will take it with them and treat their own children at home. Ready-to-use therapeutic food is powerful medicine. This peanut-based formula is effective easy to use and empowers mothers. And most kids love it. It's more than just peanut butter. Over years of careful experiments and testing, Dr. Minari and his colleagues developed a new formula. It's a precise blend ideal for bringing children back from the edge of starvation. The results are dramatic. Six weeks after their first visit, Alefa and Pelorani return for one of their checkups. What we've seen over the course of the last six weeks has been uh, really good progress. Mm -hmm. So we're hopeful that she'll come completely up to a healthy weight for this child. Mm -hmm. After six weeks of treatment, Pilarani is on a promising path. He is now likely to remain healthy and avoid lingering consequences. 95% of these children are recovering. 95%. That is really something powerful. <laughs> and this success rate comes at a fraction of the old therapy's cost. Today, saving one child costs the project a total of about $25.
Project Peanut Butter has an ambitious vision to save over two million children from severe malnutrition by 2015. I wish Project Peanut Butter would grow like a baobao tree, which is that small and grows big, 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 and biggest. So it can reach every needy child. You can make a difference. Please go to projectpeanutbutter.org Learn more about this urgent, life-saving work. Remember, there is hope. Despre boala mea am aflat în 2002. Boala asta este ca și un fel de dușman. Cu un dușman mă lupt. Deci și cu medicamente că te-aș lua tot, parcă de tot nu am timp niciodată. Conștiința, trupul meu se, se bate cu virusul ăsta încercând să-l omoare. Dar eu arăt bine în aspect fizic. Acesta este un dosar cu totul special. Înscris toți cei 1720 de copii infectați HIV în județul Constanța. Asta spuneam că rog să mă creadă, îmi aduc aminte absolut despre fiecare copil aici în îmi vine în imagine. Îl, îl am în imagine. Sigur că inclusiv cei morți, pentru că au murit mulți. Începută de atunci când am văzut că ei, dacă îi ajuți, uite că trăiesc, credința mea că ei vor trăi. Nouă copii suntem aici în casă care suntem seropozitiv. În spital m-am infectat, când era mic. Țin minte, dar din câte mi s-au spus, aveam un an, un an aveam de când m-am lăsat părinții. În România, discriminarea este foarte serioasă. Să fii 
sănătos, n-am uitat ce ai, prin ce am trecut împreună, da? da? Dar de acum înainte... Acum am făcut... Oh, astăzi am făcut 18 ani și nici nu vine să cred că am făcut. Până o muri. Aș vrea să mai să, să fac ziua până o muri. Asta îmi vine să Asta vreau să cred. decided to take surgery to the underserved parts of the country by means of an operating room built on a truck. It's a very humane way to deliver surgery, I think. People in their own environment, they don't have to be separated from the family, from the home. Almost five million Ecuadorians live in impoverished rural areas with little or no access to basic health services. Dr. Edgar Rodas tackles this problem by bringing the hospital to the people. Since 1994, his Sinterandes Foundation has been providing surgical care for hard-to-reach communities spread across Ecuador. Oscar Fuerte is a fish trader. Suffering from a condition that requires surgery, he cannot work to support his family. ¿De dónde vamos a sacar un dinero para una operación? ¿Y qué, qué tipo de operación es? Es alguien legal, yo tengo alguien legal. Está bien, no me deja trabajar. When we go to towns that are far away and very poor, we don't charge absolutely anything. The idea is that nobody, nobody can not have an operation because they don't have money. After six months of living with a disabling hernia, Oscar is ready for his operation. Oscar Fuerte is a leader in the community and had lots of friends. All the community was concerned about him. Dígame. Oscar, con el doctor Rodas habla, ¿cómo está? No ha tenido ningún problema. Vaya, me alegro mucho, me alegro mucho. For the general public health is just the absence of disease. 
to me, health is related with every human activity. We have an Andean definition of health. Salud is la convivencia armónica del ser humano consigo mismo, con el medio ambiente y con los demás. Don't go away. When we return, a comedy routine about AIDS prevention and see the winner of the View Change Film Contest Leadership Prize. Like what you saw? Then visit viewchange.org, Link TV's brand new multimedia website. Watch over 200 stories about new solutions to the developing world's biggest challenges. Get involved with the issues, share the stories with friends, and help change the world. All at viewchange.org. On earth, two things involved. You may either born a woman or a man. If you born a woman, you are safe. If you born a man, two things involved. So I've just forgotten. Do you know me? My Oh, okay. If you kill someone, oh no. Yeah. So, oh yes. If you kill someone, you are safe. I'm stuck. When you come to earth, there are two things involved. You either get STIs or HIV. When you get other STIs, you are safe. But when you get HIV, there is one thing involved. You develop AIDS, you will die. It ends there. Why would you come to Mo? Seven years now. The name of our group is Umoza Youth Organization. Our group started in late 1999. The objectives of the group are to fight against HIV AIDS to prevent mother-to-child transmission of HIV AIDS. So we try to make some songs. Mainly we perform drama before they, people are get tested. People get entertained while they get the message. Mm. Yeah. This leg, this kaposis, is a stage four of HIV and AIDS. So if I know, if I could have taken the drugs earlier than this, I think I could have not. It could have, it could have not come to this extent. Mm -hmm. But just because it was too late, so I used to say, if I can find my friends, if they are, I can see their the situation is not good, I used to say, please guys, go to the hospital, just so that they should discover you earlier the better. God also gave me a talent of composing songs, so I've got a task of composing songs and spreading the message, and I'm teaching my friends songs and the like. This song is Chemwari Chemwari, and it is advising uh, some readers that they should uh, take care of themselves, just because this time the world is full of HIV and AIDS. So this is uh, the number, pray guys.
you know, in life there are two things involved, you know. <laughs> Keeping involved, marker. If you contact HIV and AIDS, there are two things involved. You can stay wrong or die. If you are you are die, you are safe. But if you stay wrong, there are two things involved. Okay. And you can improvise. Just wait, just wait. There are two things involved. If you, you follow the strokes instructions for the doctor or, or joining groups which involve in HIV and AIDS. Something like that. <laughs> and now, the winner of the View Change Film Contest Leadership Prize, Robbie Bresson's The Witch Doctor. Mr. Mao, first of all, I'd like to congratulate you for coming in voluntarily. And like I said, you can still live a normal, healthy, productive life with HIV. Is there anything you'd like to know? No, there's none. Just tell me. The results are clear and you're HIV positive. Do you mean positive? It just means that the virus is active in your body, but it does not automatically mean that you have AIDS. And you're not going to actually have Let me advise that you go to hospital and have your T-cell count taken so that we can immediately start you on ARVs. This is a brochure. It has everything that you need to know about how to live positively with HIV. Come in, my son. Tell me what ails you. I, I want you to help me. I've been unwell for quite some time now. Mm -hmm. I had this persistent cold. Then after that, I developed some swellings. Mm -hmm. Now, they want me to take this T-count test for HIV. I'm sure there's another way of doing this. Definitely, yes, most definitely. We can do it traditional or spiritual. Mm -hmm. But please, just tell me what you want me to do and I'm going to do it. We shall consult the ancestors. What, what do I have to do? Okay, but I hear if I sleep with a virgin, I can cleanse myself. Oh my God. Give me your right hand. Connect with your ancestors. Yes. No, I won't do some of these sacrifices. Stop it, please. There, there, there are some things I can do. I won't count anybody's genitals and I won't bring any albino's blood. But you genitals. might have to. What then? You cannot back out now. Please, will you hold this with your left hand? This is how you will connect with your ancestors. From your head to your heart, right down. It is now too late to go back. The ancestors have spoken. The answer is right here. 
Yes, young man. Let us go, let us move now. Ancestors, we do not know who we are. Do not worry, young man. You see, as the pamphlet says, you can still live a fully productive life, even if you are HIV positive. <laughs> Like what you saw? Then visit viewchange.org, Link TV's brand new multimedia website. Watch over 200 stories about new solutions to the developing world's biggest challenges. Get involved with the issues, share the stories with friends, and help change the world. All at viewchange.org. about the program you just watched or to share your thoughts visit linktv.org <laughs>